Hey, before you go to Home Depot or Lowe's to buy your next vinyl fence, I just want to show you something real quick, and it might surprise you. Okay, so let me flip my camera around. So here we have two panels, okay? On the right is the panel from SJ Fence Supply, and on the left is a panel from Home Depot. Okay, so the first thing you're going to notice is there's quite a bit of a height difference. Now, so if we put this up here, four inches, okay? Four inches. So if you're thinking about getting a privacy fence, well, if you're losing four inches, yes, it's still a privacy fence, but, you know, if I have a crazy neighbor, I want every inch that I can get out of that. Okay, so that is number one. The number two thing is that we weight this. So we have a scale here, okay? So basically the scale, it holds um, for pallets and whatnot, but I weight each pound, okay? So it's only me, so I can't really hold each one at, you know, while I'm doing this. Um, but I measured both of them and the panel to the left, which is a Home Depot panel, comes in at 42 pounds. And it seems like a sizable weight. Um, but when you compare it to the panels that we sell, it's actually 58 pounds. So it's about 40% heavier than Home Depot and Lowe's, okay? So this is why I've talked about before that, you know, you have these billion dollar companies, they, the main concern is profit, right? Which is fine. But what they end up doing is they go to the manufacturers and they say, you know, look, I only want to pay X amount per panel. So what happens? Well, that manufacturer will actually water down their product and to make it that price point. The way they water it down, it's not physically through water, but then what they end up doing is, I'm going to flip my camera around, is they cheap out in a few areas. Okay, number one, as you see here, they cheaped out on the, the height. They're calling it a, a, you look down here, a six foot privacy panel, but it is nowhere near six foot. Obviously it's four inches short of that, okay? So that's a little deceptive. The other thing that you can start looking at is the rails, okay? So we have here, and it's kind of hard to see, but we have basically the indent here, and then we have this notch, this notch, and then this one is here. So there's basically four areas of support, okay? Now, when we come to here, what they did is something a little bit similar, is that they have, you know, they have this section up here, they have this, and they have this. So they have three sections, plus they put in this little groove as well, okay? What the problem, as you see here, let me put down my tape measure, is that these, you can already see this, it's very flimsy material. Okay, so this was supposed to be straight and it's already, you know, misaligned even though it, like, it hasn't been used yet. Here, again, we haven't even touched it and you can't really tell that well, but you can see there's actually a crack right in here as well. Um, so, you know, in here, before even used, this is, um, you know, broken off as well. Okay, tape measure dropped. Okay, so along with the, you know, deceptive marketing practices you know you're losing four inches but and then again about 40 percent less material but another thing that you have to concern yourself out with is like when you go to home depot and lowe's like you're probably not installing fences for a living so you're probably gonna have some questions well the problem is that at home depot and lowe's you are gonna have little johnny this 18 year old kid that is trying to sell you a fence or tell you about installing a fence he doesn't know what he's talking about. He's probably never installed a fence. He's probably never picked up a set of hand tools and it's not gonna do you any good, right? So what happens? Well, you end up talking to him, then you go back to online and then you end up looking on YouTube and everywhere else and trying to figure out how to install a fence. So that's the one way to do it. The other way that you can do it is basically you call us or you stop in and we will explain what to do. Even better than that is on Wednesdays, we actually have it where we will train you from 8.30 in the morning till 10 o'clock. We'll show you pretty much 90% of what you need to know. So that way you'll have the confidence needed to actually install your fence, okay? Now price, price is obviously very important. And with you know Home Depot and Lowe's being a billion dollar company, obviously they have a lot more buying power than we do. So typically their pricing is going to be less, but it's not, okay? So our, for them, basically the panels are coming in at $116 and $44 per post, okay? So for SJ Fence Supply, they're $108, so you're saving uh, $8 right there, okay? And then the posts are $35, so you're saving another $9 there, so it's a total of $17. 
So if you have a you know an average job of about 20 panels and post, then you're gonna save about $340 along with getting, you know. So you're gonna save $340. You're gonna get a full six foot panel. You're gonna get a panel that weighs 58 panels instead of 42. And then you're gonna be able to deal with knowledgeable people that are able to walk you through installing a fence. The other thing that we do, if you do not want to install and you just want to get the best price you can on your materials, which we do have the best price, is that we can connect you with contractors. So we have a few fence companies and then we also have um, just contractors. It's basically, you know, a guy and his helper. Um, they're licensed, they're insured. They work with other fence companies. So what ends up happening is you can get your price for much cheaper than you can anywhere else because you're going to save hundreds on your fence. And then you're also going to save hundreds on the installation as well. So what used to be a very expensive project, we've been able to eliminate a lot of the cost involved. So and a lot of the headaches. Uh, so anyway, if you would like more information, you would like to talk, you would like to get a quote, give us a call. We can actually give you a quote right over the phone. It's super simple. Give us a call and we'll use a GPS program and we'll say, okay, looks like your project will cost about this much for materials. And then if you would like to do it yourself, you can do that. Or we can connect with other contractors that again, will do a great job for a fair cost. So hope you have an awesome day and talk to you soon. Thanks.